A traffic alert for drivers who are coming in and out of downtown Indy. A stretch of Meridian Street is closed for repairs to Indigo's red line. WRTV's Caitlin Kendall joins us live tonight with the latest on that construction. And Caitlin, I understand many people, including myself, didn't know that this construction was starting when it did. Yeah, Nicole, you're right. You are not alone. Many people I spoke to say they didn't know about this closure until they drove downtown and they found this road closed signs and construction equipment hard at work. Meridian Street between 16th and 22nd Streets, a main thoroughfare in and out of downtown Indianapolis, temporarily closed. I don't know how I'm going to get back down there, so yeah, it's confusing. The closure coming on as a surprise to many who were coming in and out of downtown Thursday. Because I can't go all the way through. I have to do the detour. The detour is for Indigo's $5.1 million red line enhancements, as they call it. They say the upgrades will give additional long-term stability and protect this transportation investment. They'll add additional rub rails and repair damaged pavement on bus lanes and station bus paths. It's a reconstruction of sorts for the line less than four years after original construction. Yeah, I think it's uh, not great that they're having to redo it after it was just torn up not too long ago. People who ride the red line and live nearby say it's a bit of an inconvenience. I pay for the bus, so I should be able to go all the way down. I have to get down on 16th Street, and I have to walk all the way down the 25th and 30th, and it's confusing, very confusing. The bus stops on this stretch of roadway are temporarily closed. It, it means a longer walk. But Indigo says they're offering temporary bus stops, and the red line is still operating during construction. I have no choice until they get that taken care of. Indigo did tell me when I asked why no one was made aware of this closure ahead of time, they say that they let people know through their weekly newsletter, their monthly newsletter. They also say that they let people know through their community outreach team. I'm also told that at every single red line bus stop, they also have on the bus boards information about closures so that riders know where they can get on at alternate bus stops. Regardless, if you knew about this closure or not, it's going to stay closed for the next two to three weeks. Live in downtown Indianapolis, Caitlin Kendall, WRTV. Caitlin, thank you. The suggested detour while this closure is in place is to use 16th Street, Central Avenue, and 22nd Street.